Thor. My gosh, what am I gonna do here? Thing, Fantastic Four. Oh, all these different Hydra, there's minions and aim minions. Uh, these other Fantastic Four. Sinister S Squirrel? All right, so this video is gonna be priorities. Uh, I'm gonna just get into kind of what I've been working on, how I've gotten from, it's been about a month since I've done the last one. So how did I get from there to where I'm at now? I'm really gonna focus on what I've done or what I'm doing right now, like what my main priorities are, but I at least share with you kind of what I've done over time to get here. So hopefully it helps and uh, it'll give you an idea of what you might want to prioritize uh, as far as in the game. And if, if, if not, you know, let me know what you prioritize and we'll kind of, you know, maybe it's something that I want to change or maybe it's something I need to focus on. Who knows? So I love hearing back from you guys. So let me know if you think uh, something's out of place and um, let's get to it. All right. So I haven't done one of these priority videos in a while. Um, and there's a lot of different stuff, uh, you know, and this the last one I did was, you know, a little over, what is it, a month ago? So uh, maybe a month and a week. So I wanted to just kind of update. I'll say I don't I typically well first for those of you who have never seen one of these videos basically over time you can scroll all the way over to uh, the first one I did was wow I'm coming on a year here almost a year ago wow all right that's interesting so uh happy anniversary to me um so anyway it was about a year ago that I uh started doing these videos and I tried to color code it to basically just show how my priorities have evolved over time I've got, you know, different groups of teams and, you know, um, there was like city for when we were, you needed to farm certain, uh, the gold orbs and the raids, a cosmic for, you know, again, challenges and, you know, different things as far as the campaigns as well, all those type of things. So it's kind of evolved into, uh, you know, what team am I focusing on for war? Uh, or, or arena or who am I f shard farming stuff like that so like I said the last video I did for this was back on uh, what is that uh, June 27th so it was a little while ago so I want to kind of tell you guys how I've evolved since then and as, on top of that kind of what I'm currently focused on so the quick part I'll try to just say is like I've evolved from my arena um, essentially because I was saving gear for Cyclops that's he's still not in the game I don't know when he's coming hopefully he's coming soonish but um, I've got my thoughts on why he's probably not in the game, and I, it, I'm guessing that he was just too strong, honestly, uh, and made X-Men too strong. But that's a total guess on my part. So, you know, and again, I had I had Fury, uh, Shield, uh, to get them built. I had them lower. They're still pretty low. They're only like 200K. Um, and I've still kind of got them up towards the top. I had some Shuri spider first farming. Um, and then you'll see this teal one that kind of just is up in the screen. That's me farming minions, um, you know, mainly because of unlocks. So, and uh, you know, or is it for an unlock and a reworked team? And I'm gonna do another video on, uh, you know, that specifically, but I just kind of want to get those shard farms done with. So I don't, you know, have anything to worry about if there's a six star farm type situation. And then, um, you know, I've got this white box in here where it's above that, it's stuff I'm actually actively working on. And then stuff below that, it's like, if I've got energy and, you know, in-game campaign energy, then I'll, I'll farm that if I can. So, uh, you know, I had some Wakanda stuff down here. And uh, again, I had Shuri and Red Star. So anyway, that stuff's kind of evolved. So let's get specific to what I'm working on right now. All right. So, and again, for those who haven't seen this, I've always got the beginners thing on the side here. It's, you know, heroes, villains, defenders, you know, essentially. So I, I still believe to this day that those are the things you want to focus on early on and you need to stick with that. So, all right. So anyway, so the first thing that I've got here, like I said, is single character focus. I'm far, uh, shard farming some of these characters. Uh, last, you know, few days ago, I was, if you didn't see my America Chavez video, I got pretty high on her. I always thought she was pretty good, but uh, after playing with her a little bit, re-looking at it, having a stream, uh, you know, I really kind of focused on her in a little bit and got her to T10, um, or actually T11, got some T4s on her. And then, so I dropped her down a bit here. I still think I might T4 her alt because it still hits pretty hard, but we'll see. I still want to do a little bit more testing uh, with that team and Blitz and uh, Arena to see how strong they can be. I don't want to just put T4s into them if they're just still, if it's only helping me punch up higher on defenders. 
so uh, outside of that i bolded the ones that i'm specifically farming um and you know you can kind of see where they're at i'm trying to get everybody to six star you know the ones that i'm struggling with obviously the raid store ones it just takes so long to farm the raid store uh you know aim and factor merc soldier it's just oh gosh um but these other ones are all campaign energy i'm not really focused on the hand blade master at this point but uh he's he's kind of coming along and then again, same thing with Hydra, uh, Grenadier, Grenader. I'm not even sure I would say that. And then Thor, I'd like to get up to at some point. Probably get him more focused once these other ones are kind of behind me and I don't have to worry about raid store gear as much. So that's that's my number one priority when I log into the game. I'm, I'm farming these characters immediately. I use all my 50 refreshes to get these shards. Um, and then the same thing is actually here, this, this Fury team here uh the reason that they're at the spot is specific jumps between um a little bit let me zoom out just slightly um is because of assault and operative i'm i'm uh shard farming those two uh as well to get to seven star i've i've neglected F fury shield forever because it was just such a long grind um and i was already pretty committed to the guardians type team when i was first starting the game so I, again i've got these other gear i could focus on them but uh, i'm not really doing it now uh because i would kind of want to see how some other things shake out and the next up um i've got here is the new Lee introduced Fantastic Four. All I obviously know at this point, since I don't have them in the game, is I need to farm bio gear. So I'm going to be farming some specific gear for that. Um, the phosphates, the the needles, I forget what they're called. Uh, you know, th that type of gear where it's specific, that type of gear where it's specific to bio. Um, you know, I'll, I'll probably go to the Spider-Man type characters, you know, Captain Marvel type characters. Just uh, anybody, uh, actually Captain Marvel, now I think about is probably a great example of who you, uh, the gear she's got that could be good to farm these guys. So I'm going to want to make sure I can get these guys, I think, to T9, T10, maybe T11. We'll see. Uh, I just, depending on how Invisible Woman comes in, and you can check out my Envoy video on exactly the details of that, but I think they're going to be pretty solid. Uh, next up, I've got, you know, basically I just hit, you know, 299 out of 300 for Green Goblin. I've got Carnage at like... First off, this is for Sherry 7 star, but I can't farm Carnage. The War Store is just, I mean, for five shards, what is it, 1,300 War Credits? It's just like, those are so valuable and so hard to get. I just, it just pains me to use those. So I'm hoping I get a good drop. Um, I don't want to buy an offer for this, but I do have five red stars on Shuri. I know Wakandans are pretty lackluster at this point, but I just, I can't, I think she's still a good character and she might fit somewhere if Wakandans don't really, you know, find a really good niche here soon. Um, and again, like I said, this, this white box just says the stuff above here is what I'm actively working on below. It's just, if I can. So next up, like I said, arena, I always try to focus on this, but right now I'm doing okay. There's not, outside of landing red stars or heavily investing in T12, T13, I can't do much here and I'm staying top 10-ish. Um, typically top five, top 10. If I, I Lately I've been forgetting to do arena at the end of the night, but oops. So I've got these dropped a little lower. I'm, I'm generally content with that. I think these other, these ones above this need to take higher priority because I need to get those teams stronger. Uh, next up is uh, Alliance War. I've been, I debated having gear tier 12 rescue brought up. Um, but again, I just don't have a lot of red stars on her. She's not seven star. So I'm like, I really, if she was seven and maybe more reds, I would do it. But I just couldn't, I, I, I her and Falcon, I really need to survive. But again, I've got red, red star restrictions and, and um, shard farming restrictions on them. So, and then again, I mentioned Wakanda. I moved from, I've got all their abilities, regular 6664 abilities maxed. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to do T4s with them yet. I don't think so, given that I don't see my me using them outside of maybe attacking a unboosted BKE team in Alliance War. Um, but I've got them there. They're thinking about, again, this used to be at the top forever, you know, slot machine red stars. But I dropped it because I just don't really have any good red stars. Miles at five and Wasp at five are just a little lackluster. So, uh, and then following by that Sinister Six, if you haven't seen my videos, I've been pretty low on them. I just, and I'm calling them a raid slash blitz team. Really, it's just a blitz team uh, for the time being. I just, you know, a guy in my alliance, Sonic, who I've talked about before, 
he's got a relatively decent center for 16. He's getting, he said the other day, I asked him how well they're beating, you know, defenders. He's like 60% of the time. And I'm like, and he's a good player. So I trust him. Like if he says they're only winning 60% of the time, no, I'm not doing it. And then the rest of this stuff is just, like I said, it's stuff I've already finished or, you know, campaign type things. So uh, in this, I, I hope this kind of helps give you an idea of what I'm doing, how I approach the game. I really try to keep uh, in as efficient, uh, you know, disciplined approach as best I can. You know, I have spent some money on the game. I don't personally consider myself a whale, but uh, I think through some, you know, proper spending, through some real hard focus, um, and just like a plan of attack, I think you can really, really boost your, you know, your collection power, your strongest team power, um, you know, much faster than you normally would if you didn't make a plan. So again, hope this video helped. Uh, I try to typically do these videos where it's, you know, uh, sharing the way I approach the game, hoping that it'll help you in some manner. Uh, if you liked it, please hammer down on that like button, click that subscription uh, button, you know, uh, click the notification bell, share with your friends, anything you feel like doing. Uh, to get the, you know, some advertising out for the channel or anything you can do to just, you know, basically get some attention for the channel is much appreciated. So again, thanks for stopping by and hope to see you guys again soon.